The Pope was welcomed to the general audience with a group of school children singing this song. They remembered the three keys to a happy family life that Pope Francis teaches. That is, to ask each other, may I, and to say thank you and I'm sorry. Pope Francis's walk through the Paul VI audience hall produced some memorable moments. He signed the doctoral thesis of a priest from India. He blessed the baby of a pregnant woman. He also affectionately greeted this child to whom he gave a rosary. Afterward, the Pope resumed his catechesis on the Our Father. He explained that this prayer holds the key to having a sincere relationship with God since he knows the person better than anyone else. Impossible. Davanti a Dio, non c'è trucco che abbia potere. Dio ci conosce così, nudi nella coscienza. E fingere non si può. The Pope spoke about how the Our Father helps fortify a relationship with God. This is the place where every Christian has a personal encounter with Him. It is a casual dialogue where eloquence is not necessary. L'uomo e Dio incrociano gli sguardi. E quello è preghiera. Guardare Dio e lasciarsi guardare da Dio. Quello è pregare. Ma padre, io non dico parole. Ma guarda Dio, lasciati guardare da Lui. È una preghiera, è bella preghiera. The Pope reminded the pilgrims that the Christian relationship to God should not be individualized. He challenged pilgrims with this question. What word does not appear in the Our Father? Qual è la parola che manca nel Padre Nostro che preghiamo tutti i giorni? Manca la parola io. Una volta un capellano di un carcere mi ha fatto una domanda. Mi dica, padre, quale è la parola contraria al io? Io ingenuo ho detto tu. Eh, quello è l'inizio della guerra. La parola opposta al io è noi, dove c'è la pace, tutti insieme. As usual, the Pope concluded his catechesis by greeting newlyweds and the sick. His final blessing was given while wearing a special stole, one made by indigenous women. Would you like to see the Pope up close and personal? Download the Rome Reports app right now on your phone. There are versions available for both iPhone and Android, in Spanish and English. You will receive the best images of Pope Francis every day right to your cell phone, including his daily homily, his trips around the world, his meetings with global leaders, his acts of mercy to the needy, and of course, everything about World Youth Day. All this in a short and direct format Brief videos of one to two minutes, so you can watch wherever you are. Open your cell phone now, download the Rome Reports app, and follow Pope Francis everywhere.